Captain's Log. Tuesday. Commander Sark is investigating a strange signal from an unknown planet. Captain, why do you refer to me as Sark? Why, Sark? Because we must always be mindful of our greatest enemy, the Klongons. Not quite. I'm talking about Copyright lawyers. Captain, there is interference with our long range sensors. What is it this time, Sock? Nexus wave, gravitational field, back hole eating itself, sideways. I'm unable to detect the source of the signal. Don't worry yourself, old friend. One of our brave, highly trained ensigns will teleport down to the planet alone to test their metal and discover the source of the signal. Now, you descend. You. Now, Carter, it's Cart right. Cart right. Get yourself to the teleporter room. Permission to change shirts, Captain. Permission denied, Ensign. The shirt is an honor. And it really makes your eyes pop. Before you go, don't forget. The basic rules of planet exploration. Of course, Captain, the prime directives. I will observe them at all times. Not the boring Federation rules. <laughs> My rules have served me well. Rule one. If it resembles in any way a crocodile on legs, shoot it. Or failing that, Judo chop. Always does the trick. Rule two. If it's a gassy cloud, if it's an omnipotent rock, if it might melt you, dissolve you, evolve you, run away. We call it Captain Kick's Heroes Retreat. They, uh, they teach it at the academy, I believe. Now pay attention, Carter. Cartwright, Cartwright. Ensign Cartwright. Totally learn all your names when you board. Rule three is the most vital. It's helped me spread peace throughout the galaxy. If you encounter a being that is in any way attractive, you must, you must seduce it for peace. I'll do my best, Captain. You got this. Remember your training. Shoot. You go chop. Run. Seduce. Come in. Car right. Come in. Zock? Do we have any readings? Captain, Ensign Cartwright has discharged his weapon. A uh, rule three? Beam me down immediately for a uh, captain intervention. Not that kind of discharge, Captain. Such a tactic would be illogical. Ah, I see. Come in. Come in. Car, car, come in, come in, come in, come in. Car. Car right to bridge. I've got one out of two. <clears throat>
And I've done a one and a two. Ah, Captain! Captain, help me! Ah! Ah! Captain, we are reading zero life signs from Ensign Cartwright. Shall I add his name to the wall? This will take a moment for our fallen colleague, a hero. He will always be remembered. Here's to you, Ensign Carter. So, lunch? <laughs>